in our countries, on our continent. No one carries everything they come to the table when they leave the table. Give and take. That's the meaning of negotiations. Give and take. If you come to the table to take, you don't come into dialogue. You are coming to put fuel to the conflict. I'm talking generically. I have no specific reference point. All I know is that we are all delighted on the continent when Southern Sudan gained it, it, its independence. We understand the history, not as deep as the Southern Sudanese do understand it, not as deep as the other Sudan understands, not even as deep as Kenyans, Ugandans, Ethiopians, those in the region. But we on the Southern African part of the continent follow these processes and we're looking forward to cessation of hostilities in the wider Sudan once independence was gained. We did not budget for what is going on in Sudan. And I think it was the right thing to do. We budgeted for peace, security, stability, for development. Simple. Peace, security, stability, for development. Resources are limited. The resource envelope is small for anyone, any country. How we utilize those resources must not be towards waging war, but towards building schools, health centers, food security, which we've been discussing. That's where the resource envelope must go. I really believe, President Ruto, you singled me out so you know my mind, and I will rest with that said publicly. Instability anywhere is instability everywhere. We know it. We're all affected by the Russia-Ukraine war. So when you Southern Sudanese brothers and sisters are fighting, remember you are exporting problems to all of us. We would like to be part of the solution to help you restore stability and focus your attention on development. President Ruto, thank you very much. Thank you. Sanchez.